Venice is facing its worst floods ever. The Italian city has been inundated as water levels rose to 150 centimeters above sea level. High tides on Sunday night had been expected to push that level close to two meters, but the city seems to have had a minor reprieve, as Claudio Lavanga reports. Venetians are used to high tides, but they have rarely seen anything like this. On Sunday morning, they woke up to a city submerged by a meter and a half of water, one of the highest tides on record. At its peak in the morning, 80% of Venice was flooded. The only way to walk around was on raised platforms. The high tide is caused by a combination of astronomical and meteorological factors. The water rises regularly, but days of heavy rain and a strong Sirocco wind has made this an exceptional tide. Local expert Pierpaolo Campostrini says that this is yet another sign that Venice is under serious threat. This kind of event uh, happened uh, more often in the last decades uh, to do the climate change uh, which make uh, the sea level rising uh, and also that the local condition of the city of Venice uh, which is subsiding. So this means that uh, we have now the level of the city is 20 centimeters uh, below uh, than uh, the level of which it was uh, 40 years ago. For a few hours in the afternoon most of the water receded back into the lagoon but by nightfall it started coming back reclaiming the city one step at a time. St. Mark's Square is the lowest point in Venice and it's the first place to get flooded. On Sunday evening, the water started coming back in and it's expected to stay here at least until Monday morning, when Venetians will have no choice but try to keep their heads above water. Claudio Lavanga, Al Jazeera, Venice.